Hello guys, welcome back. I'm Julie and I'm here to do my reaction video for season 1 episode 14 of All American. This time the title of the episode is Regulate. And yes, we are back. We are here. We are ready for a new episode of All American. One this show honestly is one of the best shows and I cannot believe that it airs in the US on the CW. Like what the hell? Honestly, because on the CW, you have Riverdale as well. <laughs> so it's like, what is happening here? Uh, but yeah, anyways, uh, we have episode 14. We are only, after this episode, we are only two episodes away for the season one finale. And honestly, I can't wait. I can't wait to watch it. I can't wait to share my reaction with all of you. And honestly, just to get to that point, because I feel like things like season one is so good. And people keep saying that the, the la la uh, latter seasons, like, you know, season two, season three, they're even better. So, I can't wait. <laughs> anyway, so we're going to do episode 14. It ended with, uh, episode 13 ended with, um, with, uh, with Spencer's dad coming back and saying to Grace, I can no longer do this. I have to be there for my son, which is amazing. For Spencer, but like, what is the drama there? I wanna know. I wanna know. So, episode 14. I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you guys like it. Please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you love All American. Subscribe, comment, hit the notification bell, and you can go to Patreon and watch the full uncut extended version for this reaction and so much more. Probably by the time that you're watching this on YouTube, I'm already done with season, with season one. Probably on season two. So if you guys want to check that out, link on the description down below. And yeah, for now, that's about it. Without further ado, let's just begin with season one, episode 14 of All American. Ooh! You don't get to call me that. Spencer. <gasps> no. Shit. It's okay. <gasps> okay. Okay. Mind if we have a little talk? It's time, isn't You've been it? Back in LA, ever since you left Eastern. Oh shit! <laughs> Am I the only one who feels the tension right now? <sighs> what is this, Billy? Billy. Ooh, I don't think they like each other. You guys good? Let him be. Yeah, let him be. Let him process this. Ooh. Oh shit. Oh, Spencer. My poor child. My poor child. I don't like that he's going through shit. You know, but I think that, you know, in my case, you know, when I, I was like a lot later in life, when I was young, very young, I thought, you know, why can my parents just make made out, you know, and be back together, and I can have both my my parents together? Turns out that many years later, once I grew up, once I finally understood the reasons, you know, I understood that my mom made the right call of of not having him around us. Because he was not a good person, because he has his own um, demons to battle, if you know what I mean. Um, and it was not going to be a good example for me or for my brother. So she made the right call, but I understood that later, you know, and I, I, I you know, it's a touchy subject to talk about. But <sighs> what I mean is that. Eventually, Spencer, one way or another, will have to make peace with who his dad is and why his dad left and what it means for him that he left. Whether if it was his fault, it was everyone else's fault. The dad should have been there for his son for all these eight years. What he wants to think about that, Spencer, it's his own thing, but... It will depend on him how to how how he handle it. You know what I mean? Whew. Damn, that was that was that was intense. You have me scared. Hello. Ain't nothing to be scared. Oh no, she's 
having a bad dream. No. Shit. No. Shit. Wake up. No, it's just me. Oh. It's just me. Just breathe. Just breathe, Coop. Just breathe. Oh, that's so sweet that she's there for her, you know? <laughs> like, the more I see them, the more I like this ship. They're so... They're so cute. Coop is like... Is there something that you... Yeah, you, you look good this morning. <laughs> Coop. I mean, it's, it's something about the way the sun is hitting your face. This ought to be over, man. Well... She might not know why she's having this. Yeah. It, it's be, we, but she knows now. Patients know about the fact that it's do 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 do. It's um that she wants to take you know have revenge on Tyrone. You know, yes, she wants this to be over, but she knows that, right? My other guy, <laughs> nice playoff win last night. A pick, a sack, and three touchdowns. Yes. <laughs> is this yes. what I think it is? Mm. The Dylan James Fun and Games birthday wish list. Oh. Okay. Drop guns. Wait, hold up. Is this list growing? Come <laughs> on. <laughs> gotta make each one count. Hey, I got you, little man. You gonna get everything on this list, all right? Aww. And we're fitting all of that in what backyard? <laughs> this is little brother. I love that. And you paying for all of this how? Flip's cousin got a party store. Your father, it's been a week. Oh, it's been a week. No. But that's his M.O., right? My dad doesn't even remember our birthdays. <laughs> Great game last night. Bum, we didn't get a chance to talk. Oh, yeah, now you want to talk to him. I thought I left enough in there. <laughs> For who? A cat? Since when did you start liking almond milk anyway? I have a plan. What's the plan? Do you want to share? Man, don't call me. <laughs> You're right. Her boo is named Micah. <laughs> nah, boo got more weight on it. <laughs> <laughs> you don't stop playing. But throwing a loud ass party right in his face? You think that's the right move? Cool. It's a kid's party. She can't freeze the egg pop guns. How annoying it is that you have to worry about gangs when you're in the Flip. park, you yeah, know? You love one? Stay home. Ah, boy. You... <sighs> the fuck this man here, man? wants? It's a free sidewalk, ain't it? Word on the street oh. is you're planning a party at the park. It's a public park. Oh, Nobody shit. can touch him. Oh, shit. But, like, the fact that he feels threatened by a kid's party, like, Tyrone, man. But that's the gang mentality right there for him. Look, maybe we should move the party, man. Hell no. Maybe we should. Listen, Tyrone may be a lot of... Look, man. Stays. Come on, man, we're working. Look, I don't know, like, kids are going to be there, and, like, if it's not safe, is it really good for us to be, like, all proud and, like, he's not gonna do anything? And, like, I don't know, man. I think this man is ready to cross all lines. This is just me. God damn it! Do you fly? He was he was just in the other side. Like now she he, does he have a tele teleportation device or something? The secrets like the rest of us. Okay, preach. Are you real chatty all of a sudden. Yeah. Oh, cool. You grew up in church, right? I, I ain't done that in years. But you have done that before. I'm playing. Damn. Sorry. Hey. Oh my god! You a damn flip what a little mark ass football kid. I'm gonna handle that when the time is right. Wait, let's not push this guy's but see, this is what I'm telling you. That like he wants to prove that he is the shit, you know? Ugh. He's very dangerous.
Did Asher just throw a party in a house that doesn't belong to him? I know that he has done it in the past, but come on. A few friends. Your friends better be out of here in 10 minutes or I'm calling the cops. Oh, shit. Go. You should have asked permission, though. It's not your house. I, I thought that you wouldn't mind since you throw epic parties here all the time. Like, why didn't you Under just her permission. permission. I was scared you'd say no. Well, it is her but house. It worked out. His love is... Conditioned. Conditional. Yeah. I don't need him. Figure something else out. Well, I can't respect that. I can't respect that, you know. His dad was like, you're out of the teen, you're out of my house. So... Happy birthday, 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 happy I didn't come here for all that. I just want to give Dylan his gift. Come on. I already missed a birthday party, so. Damn it. I I I respect what I respect Spencer. You know, he is like he is entitled to feel that way right now. Right. So do I shake or do I not? Definitely do not shake. Do not shake. Spencer, huh? <laughs> <laughs> there he is. Hey, hey. Wow. Someone who doesn't like birthday parties. Let's go put that down. Yeah. She's so sweet. What's up, coach? Shit. I think Billy and Corey need to have a a word. About time we talk, oh, bitch. Fine. After party. It's sad, though, right? I haven't seen one of these in years. You still get these? <laughs> what else don't you see? Your name and the headline? Okay, stop blaming Billy. That way. Given a seat at the table. There you go. That's yours. Ah, you want to see that? That's just yours. You want to pull it? Where the gifts go? Where the nurse What the boyfriend is here? Martha. Hey, you're here. <laughs> she does the same. Uh, Dylan invited me. Now you have no clue. No, mm. no, no. She has it's a fair, much, no, well, I'm... fair share of ex-boyfriends are, are around already. <laughs> she doesn't need need a new boo here. <laughs> Micah. Oh, I love her smile. Oh, somebody in their feelings. No, because <laughs> oh, no, like, I don't know. Things have changed. But she ain't said nothing. Sounds like of she has course. Some kind of PTSD. Yeah, it does. But they didn't start till this week. I guess I was just mean. Oh, some. Yeah. I was like that with my mom. The fuck? Hey, listen, hanging there with my mom's eye. Right? She likes you. Trust that. And you make her smile, and that's what's important to me. That's good. Excuse me. That's good that he said that. Are you leaving already? I'm just finna sing happy birthday. Yeah, save me a piece of cake. You ain't gotta do this, Coop. Stop lying. Look, I can see it on your face, Coop. Enough is enough. Yeah. You can figure out some other way to deal with Tyrone, all right? And you know I'm right. It ain't that easy. Now you... I ain't trying to be here all damn day. Time to get it. Oh, oh my God. God. It's all right. I got it. For real this time. Shit. Stop looking at him like that. Or her. Preach. Can't what? I can't make this move with you. I deal with Tyrone. Oh shit. Oh. Hey, Coop. Everything okay? Yeah. No. Is the uh, DA office still looking for a way to take down Tyrone? Yeah, I know for a fact that they are. Okay. Is it 
cool if I come over and talk to you tonight? Absolutely. Yeah, but be careful, okay? okay. Extremely okay. careful. Okay, that's that's a, okay. Oh god, I hope that she's not putting a target in her bag, you know? Oh. Okay, but. What's up, little man? Thanks for the best birthday ever. Oh, that's so sweet. Always. That's so sweet. Oh, so sweet. That depends. Is Rumi still here? <laughs> Not for long. Okay, be careful though. Oh my god. I've been robbed. Of course, if the door is open. Shit. They picked through the whole place. They took art and jewelry and TVs. Oh my god. Safe. One was wearing a red t-shirt, the other two had on hoodies. Excuse me. Okay, that could be literally anyone, right? Maybe, I'm real sorry, but I'm gonna have to step out real quick. Wait, you think that it was Tyrone? Dad, Grandpa really already explained all that, okay? He didn't mean to step on Spencer. That's where oh, you're wrong. Oh, come on. That man meant it. Everything went down exactly the way he wanted it to. But you gotta ask yourself, is this how you want to get your wins in life? By stepping on your friends, huh? Ask yourself that. I gotta get out of here. Well, he does have a point, you know. Coach Billy so Baker. Me. Why did you want to have this meeting in my office? But given the circumstances at that time, it felt like the only thing to do. Why? Leaving your kids felt like the only option. Not that I owe you an explanation. Why are you back now, Corey? Oh, he's dying or something. I miss my family. I always have. Just never seemed to find the right time to pick up the phone. You must be forgetting that I have the power to upend your happy life. Oh, what do you mean? More than you know. What do you mean? When it comes can, to Spencer. Can we like, can we stop with the riddles? <laughs> I want to know what the hell happened. I am not going to force him to do anything that's not in his best interest. Bullshit. And be honest, if you really wanted to make things right, and you let all this work out in its own time. It's on record that Preach was offered a deal to testify against Brandon and refused. Also, they were- loyal dude. Yeah. It's good to know. How do you know it's Tyrone? The main suspect was a black dude, medium build with a red t-shirt on. That's it? Yeah. Hey, Rocky Science cool. What else do I need? I don't know, maybe an actual real description. Burglary is not Tyrone's thing, especially not in Beverly Hills. They hit up Layla's house, cool. Where she stay at alone, you still got Tyrone's back after that? I would never okay. have his back over yours, and you know that. Yeah. I'm just pointing out the facts. Damn, you've been in Beverly Hills all of a minute, and you already profiling your own people? Hey, I'm a oh. ride or die, and you know that. It damn sure don't seem like it. Yeah, but that is true. They gave well, a very vague description of who the intruders might be. Let's be real. Ty Tyrone might be up, you know, to do some bad things, and he might as well be, but... Like, what are the chances that he's not the only, you know, criminal in town? Like, come on, dude. You go. You ain't gonna talk to Tyrone. I will. No, that's stupid. That's stupid, Spencer. Can you follow him? He's about to do something stupid. You have anything to do with my security cameras being off? Oh my God. I'm sorry, Layla. So are we going to ignore the obvious here on purpose? What is the obvious? Let's see. Spencer has been fighting with the gangs in his neighborhood. Spencer has been Don't living you at your house. Spencer has never brought danger into my home. Can you say the same? He hasn't. He hasn't. Has pack your stuff, Ash. Shit. Are you kicking me out? There is a dark, rough side to Crenshaw, but there is a dark, rough side to Beverly Hills, too. 
your friends just proved that. Well, you know what? It is more reasonable that it was someone from your house Hi. than from ah. your party than Ty. Red bone, long hair. Oh, okay. Fly ass crib in Beverly Hills. That ain't how we handle problems, all <gasps> You got me confused, bro. I ain't Sean. I'll put your ass down like a dog and won't think twice. Matter of fact. Stop, stop, stop. Ain't been nothing but problems lately. Stop, stop, stop. Nah, nah, nah. Hey. Uh, hey, stop! Oh my Good luck god! Good luck both our bodies in five of them. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! I fucking hate You're you! Not lucky this time. I'm so stressed. Oh my god! Is off me, man. Oh my god! I need your help, I. Right? It didn't look that way to me. How'd you find me? You didn't. You didn't need his help. If he wasn't here, I will be crying right now because he just shot you. So, shit. Spencer, you can't be doing shit like that. That was reckless. I was so focused on doing Dylan the perfect birthday party that I got too comfortable. No. I let my beef with Tyrone effect later. Well, you don't know for sure if it was Tyrone or anybody else you know. You sound like Coop. Not surprising, given the week that you've had. Oh, come on, this ain't had nothing to do with my pops, all right? Of course it does. Of course it does. You are like a walking poster for the Nile. You're obviously upset with Corey. That's why you picked a fight with Tyrone. If you don't face your demons, they will eat you alive. That's very true. What do you say? I should talk to my pops for real? I think it's in your best interest. You do. Don't become like me and my father. Is he doing this because he feels threatened by what 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 uh Corey said? Sweetheart. Where's Olivia though? Where's my girl? Hello. A local bling ring that's been hanging up the neighborhood the past month. Uh, Coop, an apology. Hey, for the record, I never thought this was connected to you. Yeah. Should have never compromised your safety like that. True. Actually, it wasn't you. Some bling ring. I appreciate the offer, but... He's tired of getting kicked out. It kind of gave me the kick in the ass that I needed. Giving it another shot with my dad. Really? I won't know if he's changed, so I go. Okay. Uh, that's that's awesome. Good for you. Is it true, though? Okay. 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 Yes. Okay. That's good. You can fight it, right? Yeah. Okay. I like that. Tyrone had your fan killed. You mean to tell me you cool with that? Oh shit, you're getting his head. What? Oh, she's so scared. Good looking out, Coop. Oh, he's gonna cover her for so you. What now? You... What does that mean? I don't know. Exactly what you wanted to mean. <gasps> then we're gonna kill Tyrone ain't gonna be nobody's problem. No more. Oh, d d okay. Um, is that what you wanted? I mean, kinda, but like, no, but like, yes, but like, I don't know. <laughs> I'm scared, man. Huh. Thanks oh. again for watching your brother tonight. Oh, she looks happy. So, how's Mike? There's something I need to tell you. Ooh. What? Oh, tell me. Something I should have told you a long time ago. <gasps> what is it? The tea. Here it comes. Oh, no, they're going to cut it off. I wasn't completely honest as to why your father left. Okay. Are they cutting it off? Uh, it gets impossible. They always do that. Oh. What? That is not even calling you? It's a big ass house. I will be terrifying. 
searching for another way. Oh, thank God. What child? Lock the doors. Oh, baby. I know how I just feel like this happened. It's so cute. I love this friendship. Oh. That's so sweet. My son's life for good. <gasps> He's always after the money. Holy fuck. Oh, what did your mom say? It's because out of all the people that's betrayed me, you the easiest conversation for me to have right now. But your mom betrayed you. So the cat's out the bag. What is the What was the cat? What was in the bag? Want a chance at a real relationship with me and Dylan? Okay. Or oh, you want back in my life? Cause all of a sudden I'm all over the news, and you realize your son is destined for greatness. Okay. He wanted money. Or for having an affair while they were married to you and Laura. That's why you left all those years ago, right? Because they cheated. Correct. Holy fuck. Can I imagine that? So I'm going to assume that Laura doesn't know, right? Because she's being really kind to Grace, and I don't think she will be that kind if she knew about that. So I'm thinking that she didn't know. Uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, I want to hug him so bad. My child. Okay, guys, so that was the end of season one, episode 14 of All American. And Cat is out of the bag. Okay, and I have had my doubts in the past, when, especially when Grace said that the reason your dad left had nothing to do with you or Dylan. I was like, hmm, was she, like, unfaithful? Was she the reason why he left? Now... Look, here's the thing, and here's something that we, that some parents, you know, don't understand, is that, you know, you, you can make mistakes in your personal life with your partner. You can make that mistake, you know, and, 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 you know, sometimes you think you're destined to be with this person forever. And it doesn't happen, you know. But you have children. Your, chil your children come above that, you know. Um, to me, at least, that's from my perspective. You know, you do something, you know, that is, is it's, it's, you, you're not, like, your kids are not going to be the first kids who have divorced parents, you know, sometimes you can find a healthy relationship and, you know, have your kids count on both of, of their parents. But some people just don't do that. And some people believe that they have enough time, you know, that time, like days and years go by and, and that things will not change. Or if they change, they're not going to change too much, you know. Um, and they waste time trying to reach out or not to their kids, you know. If Grace did whatever she did, because it looks like she was unfaithful uh, to, to him, to Corey, with Billy, when they were married to Laura and, uh, and Corey, respectively, you know. Uh, it, uh, uh, and, you know, even if, if they did... That is still no reason for him to abandon his family. He could very much said, that's it. You know, we are no longer in a relationship. I'm still mourning and all of that. But I want my children in my life. You know, uh, that's something that's a bond that you can break. You know, because your kids will be your kids always. You know, there is no, I cheated on, she cheated on me, you know. That, at the end of the day, doesn't matter. 
you know it matters in your life whether if you want to be a family and be you know half of what the traditional family is if you want that then you know yeah but that doesn't mean that you get to say you know what she cheated on me i'm gonna take an eight year break you know on my children and i'm just gonna walk away you know even if if um you know that happened and 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 you you like for me for instance for a long time i try to shield my son from knowing who his father truly was you know and i try so hard for them to have a relationship um but you know i can i couldn't after what happened last year I couldn't keep forcing it, you know, and there is a moment in everyone's life when you see your parents for who they are, you know, and I stop trying to get them together. I stop trying to get them to have a relationship. And guess what? It, it, it is stopped as well. He stopped calling. He stopped being there. He stopped paying childcare. He stopped doing all of that. But all of that is on him. Not on me, you know, and it shouldn't be like that for my son, but I'm not going to shield him anymore or I'm not going to protect his dad in order for Josh to have this idea of like his dad is a good person when in reality he isn't, you know, and what I'm trying to get at is that, you know, if he felt hurt. And he needed a little bit of time out, you know. He could have said to their sons and, like, eventually come to the point of, of like, we're going to tell you the reasons why we're not together anymore. But, like, I am still your dad and I'm still here for you. So, basically, what I'm saying is that Corey could have had his heart broken and fe felt betrayal, you know, all these years But all those years, all those years ago, that doesn't excuse him for leaving his kids. Okay, that doesn't excuse him. It's not like I'm not gonna sit here and say, oh, no, I understand why he left eight years ago and like I feel so bad. No, man. Like, yes, you could have break up with Grace, but you do. Shouldn't have left your kids. He could still have been a good dad. And be there for his kids, you know? But he wasn't. And that's bullshit. And, like, the relationship that he's trying to build right now is his relationship with his, with his sons. Right? Not his relationship with Grace. And she sh he shouldn't have even break that relationship in the first place. The one with his kids. You know, Grace could have slept with half of LA. That doesn't matter. Your kids are your kids at the end of the day. You know, and I understand that, that Spencer feels betrayed. Okay, because for a long time, he thought that dad left because of me. Did it have something to do with that? And Grace, yes, granted, she's been saying, you're not the reason, Dylan is not the reason you know but i think she deserved she she needed in order for spencer to not grow grow so much hatred towards his dad or not hatred but resentment towards his dad um was that okay th this is this was the reason is it still wrong that he doesn't call and he doesn't show up But the real reason why he left is this one, you know. I, I I don't know. You know, at the end of the day, does it change it? Does it change the outcome? No, because he still left and he never came back and he never contacted them, you know. So it is on him. All this resentment that 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 uh Spencer feels, it's because of him, you know? Um, and he's the only one who's going to be able to fix it or not. Now, 
Spencer said, one, you want a relationship with me and Dylan and you want to be an actual good dad, which that is the, 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 the only, vi like, valuable reason to be here. That's one. Two, you know that I'm destined for greatness and now what? You want some cash just like, like, uh, Grandpa Willie. That's number two. And number three is uh, because you want to destroy uh, Billy's life and my mom's life in the process. What is it? You know, um, he did threaten Billy. So there might be a little bit of that there, you know, and I'm pretty sure that Laura doesn't know about it because like, like if your husband cheats on, cheats on you, with 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 grace will you be like such a good friend and will you be like it's over you know it happened like eight years ago i mean laura seems very you know mature and like you know above all of this but would you i don't know i i, I don't know so, but I'm pretty sure that she doesn't know because Corey's threat will be en empty if it was like, I'm going to tell your kids that you cheated on your wife. Yeah, but like, what would you want to do that at the end of the day, right? So, I'm going to guess this because of Laura that he said that. Maybe Laura didn't find out, right? Or maybe she did. I have no idea. I have no idea. Um, but it's really interesting. Right, it's really interesting why he left, and 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 the reason why he left was this, you know, uh, thing that happened between uh, Billy and Grace uh, when they were already married to Laura and Corey, which is not a good thing that that Grace did. But like, you know, we all make mistakes, I guess. Um, you know, I mean, the fact that she did that doesn't mean that she's not a great mother. You know, because she is. You know. And I feel like she might have tried to be better as well. So, you know. <sighs> well, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see how that turns out. But finally, we get that, you know. Um, then I'm going to bet the, make the bet whether if Grandpa Willie will take the money or will he say No. I actually want to see your kid be being successful because not not because I want money but because I actually love my grandson. But let's remember that he did ask for cash for uh from from Jordan. But hey, Jordan did say I'm not going to give you more cash and I haven't heard it again, so but I mean, Willie did seem tempted. Grandpa Willie seemed tempted. You know, so I'm not sure what's going to happen there. I'm really, really not sure what's going to happen there. Anyways, what else What else happened on the episode? Uh, okay, so my bet is, uh, will he take the money or not? I think he will, but then he will regret it. I think so. I think so. Anyways, um... But Billy, you know, Billy always, you know, says one, one thing and then does the complete opposite. Uh, so, yeah. Oh, and Spencer is going to be extremely mad at him. Because he's, he's going to be like, you bitch have been, like, all high and mighty? You're a fucking cheater. You know, he's going to be mad. He's going to be mad. Um, then we have the whole oh, Tyrone thing. Like, I get Spencer and I get his passion and... Honestly, like, let's be real. Whoever, like, the neighbors say, oh, three African-American men, one had a shirt and the other one had a hoodie. Like, come on, dude. That, like, how is that, uh, 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 like, how you put an APB, like, how would you do that, right? Like, it could literally be anyone. Like, I'm not on, on Tyrone's side. Tyrone kind of said, oh, maybe I did, or, like, he didn't actually say yes or no um but the the like 
Spencer was profiling him. He wanted, that's the thing, he wanted it to be Tyrone. Because he wanted to go against Tyrone. Because he wanted to fight because he was so mad at his dad. You know, so, understandably so, he said, oh no, black dude, and I think he owns a red shirt, it must have been Tyrone. And I'm like, I'm like, dude, come on, really? You know, and Coop was 100% right. She was like, dude, you have no evidence. <laughs> like, black dude with a red shirt. Like, that, that give me more details, you know? Um, but he wanted it to be Tyrone. That's the thing, you know? But man, was that reckless? Because, like, if Corey wasn't there, I will be crying right now because I just lost my child. And that just scares the shit out of me. You know, I understand Spencer and I understand his passion, but my boy needs to be more conscious about the things that he does. You know, especially because sometimes it's our life and death type of decisions. So I'm I'm extremely scared for him, okay? Because, like, Sean, before, he was all talk, but he was never gonna hurt Spencer. But Tyrone has no code. And, like, I don't know what code that is, but, like, he, apparently he doesn't have any. You know, so we need to be careful. We need to be careful with him. And, like, Spencer needs to understand that, right? That he cannot be messing around with him. He's a bad dude. That now seems that he has a target in his back that my girl, Coop, put there. Because he was like, hey, he was your 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 homie, you know? He was your... I, I, I don't know why I say homie. Like, I know, I've never used that word before. But, like, he was your friend, you know? You were friend with, with, with his brother. And you were family, right? And you were family and you were together. And, like, you know, so technically, if you guys were family, Sean was your family. And Sean was killed by Tyrone. And Tyrone, like, he's a bad dude. And, like, Preach was, like... Okay, this is what you wanted. You wanted him out, I'm taking him out. And, like, I'm scared. Because, you know, if you have watched 100 Just Dangerous Down, it's never a good way to go. Which means uh, blood mu must have blood. And that's never a good thing. It's never a good thing. It never ends well. You know, so I'm a little bit scared. And when I say a little bit, I mean, like, extremely scared. Because it feels like there's going to be some sort of battle. And Coop is going to be there. And, like, something might happen to her. And I am... I'm a scared bitch. I am scared. <gasps> because Tyrone is a dangerous dude, you know? So I'm scared. <laughs> Did like the moment with Layla and Olivia. Because I was, like, during the episode, I was, like, halfway through. Wait. Where's Olivia? Olivia will have come to, the, to Dylan's party. Where is my child? I don't know. She was MIA the entire episode until the end. Where she was like, no, my girl Layla, she needs me there. So I'm going to be there for her. And she was. And like they were hugging and it was so cute. This gets to tell you. I'm just going to say. How much I really ship Spencer and Olivia. I mean, yes, Layla. Oh my god. I, I'm going to talk about her in a minute. But the thing is that. This is how much I, 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 I love. I, I want Spencer and Olivia to happen. Because I could very easily ship Olivia and Layla, which I like very low key kind of do. But like when I ship one couple, like there is no one else for me. Wildmore, like check me out. Like, no one else for me. Nailing, no one else for me. You know, I can't picture them with any other. Brulian, that's in my endgame. Daylena, my endgame. Fitzsimmons, my endgame. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? When I'm not that serious about the, the, the couples, you know, when I like them, but it's okay. You get, um, what was the ship name for uh, Lucas and Peyton? What was that ship name? Layton, Layton, right? Dude, I ship, I shipped, uh, um, uh, I almost said Spencer. No. I ship Peyton with a lot of girls. <laughs> I remember shipping her with, with Anna, of course. 
Then there was my ship. I, I'm, at one point, I ship her with, with Lucas's ex-girlfriend, Lindsay. I ship her with her as well. Then what was the name of the other girl? The one that 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 um that ended up marrying Dan? Oh, what was her name? Well, I ship her with her too. You know, because that's when I'm not that serious about a couple, I could ship them with anyone else, with some 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 other people, but not when like. And I it, at one point I also shipped Jake and Peyton like hard. Because I thought they were adorable, you know? So, yeah. And th in this opportunity, like, I have Layla and, and, and Olivia hugging, and I'm like, they are besties, you know? Like, very, like, low, 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 low key. I'm like, okay, they could be lesbians and they could be, like, amazing together. But, look, I want Spencer and Olivia so bad that I can't, I can't go with the gay ship. That's a lot. That's a lot. Okay. Anyways, what else happened? Oh, yes. Layla got robbed, which is like so upsetting because now she doesn't feel safe in her own home. And that is just as scary as hell. Um, but then I, I'm like, the hell, where the hell is the dad? And honestly, maybe my girl needs to live in like a smaller place with a little bit more security. Right? Because I'm scared something could have happened to her. You know, and Asher being like he left the 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 alarm system off and things like that. I'm like, oh come on, Asher, you know. But I feel bad that they were that Layla also kicked him out and like I felt bad, you know, for him. And I think that he's lying about the fact that he he's with his dad. I don't know. I feel like he's lying. And I feel bad for Asher, you know. Um, Grant, that he shouldn't have throw a poker party without her uh, consent. You know, he should ha he sh he should have asked, but he didn't. You know, and that was bad. Um, but um, yeah, but I feel bad for him when he got kicked out again. Um, but yeah, I did like the Olivia and Layla moment. I felt bad for Layla, though, right? Because she's alone there, and that just is so scary. Um, oh, Jordan talking to his grandpa, wanting his grandpa in his life. Hopefully, the grandpa is more interesting in him than the money. Although, you know, it doesn't seem like that because he was very doubtful. Like, I will be offended, right? But no, he was like, hmm... So we'll see. Uh, but Jordan needing to know more about his his roots, I think it's a great thing because it looks like Billy hasn't done a really good job at explaining him how is the life of a of a black man in America, you know, and I think that's important because Jordan will not live in a bubble for the rest of his life. I mean, I think that that Billy expects that that he goes to the NFL and he's always surrounded by by all this, you know, um, perks and things like that um but it, it it it's not always gonna happen that way you know so yeah i do think that he needs to learn right so yeah dylan's party was amazing spencer is the best brother in the planet uh and dylan had a, a great time uh micah or mika is that how they pronounce it i don't know how to pronounce it um it's like Larry with Grace and like Grace deserves to be happy, so yeah. Um, we'll see what happens there. Uh, but it was a really sweet episode wh when it came to the birthday party. It was really sweet. Uh, but yeah, we'll see what happens on the next two episodes, which I will watch them tomorrow. So stay tuned for that. Um, if you're on Patreon, you get to watch them back to back to back. So I hope you guys enjoy that. Uh, but for now, that's about it. I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you guys like it. Give it a lot of thumbs up. If you love All American, subscribe, comment, hit the notification bell, and you can go to Patreon to watch the full uncut extended version for this reaction and so much more. So in case you guys want to do that, link as always will be in the description down below. And by the time I'm, you guys are watching this, I'm probably already done with season one and on season two. So in case you guys want to check it out, like I said, the link's in the description on the description down below. 
<laughs> thank you so much guys for watching and that's it i'll see you guys next time bye guys